All right. Uh, this is uh, All Signed Singles. Who will be uh, my next Earth Angel? Okay. All right. So we're talking about dating. And I'm going to use this. And it's by Chronicle Books. Okay. All right. So here we go. Aries, my next Earth Angel date. <laughs> okay. Wow. Okay. So what I'm getting is... Even if they're women, they're all masculine in boss energy. That's what I'm getting. They're like in charge. It could be like uh, in startup or the CEO, that kind of thing. Okay. So I feel like you don't mess around. Okay. That's what I'm getting. Could be a Leo. I'm getting Pisces. Uh... Earth sign. I'm getting Taurus with this one. Okay. And I'm getting like, uh, well, it, fire sign. I'm getting all fire sign. Okay. Now, for some of you, this might be hanging out with friends and then meeting someone. Okay. So that's what I'm getting. Let's see. Let's get what date, what kind of date. Let's just say. Just the facts. Both of you write down 20 personal questions on small scraps of paper. One question per scrap. Drop them in, a separate, in separate bowls and take turns pulling the questions out of your date's bowl and answering it. Each of you can exercise the right to pass. On only one question. <laughs> I like that though, right? Because it's like, what I'm getting from this is you like to keep it real. Okay, so that could be like Libra. Okay, um, that could be another Aries here. Okay, Sagittarius I'm getting. Okay, and... Um, Really getting to know know each other. That's what I'm getting. Okay. I'll leave you with that. Okay. All right. Taurus. Your Earth Angel date. Okay, it says clarity, truth, protection. So I feel like this is someone you wouldn't question. You would know that you like them. And I feel like they're in like this kind of unity energy and in tune with not just themselves, but uh, things going on around them. Okay. Okay, so I'm getting another Taurus. Might be a great match. Okay. But I'm feeling like um, this is Aquarius is the feeling that I'm getting with this one. Okay. Aquarius. Earth and water would be nice, right? But I feel like an water with air. So that could be Pisces and someone with Pisces and air placements close. Okay. All right. That's what I'm getting. Let's see what kind of date. All right. Blind date. Oh, okay. So ask. Oh, okay. I get it. So ask someone to set you up on a date. Okay. I'll tell you what I'm getting. I'm getting, um, okay. So there was a couple in England, right? And their friends set them up and they got married and then they moved to California. 
Okay. And uh, so I feel like that might be a good way to try something different. And it's like a practice of trust too. It's like you trust your friend to set you up, right? It's like trusting energy where that opens up all kinds of channels. Ooh, I like that. Okay, so let's read blind date. Blindfold your honey and take them to a romantic dinner or surprise cultural event. Plan to have something special waiting, like flowers, special dessert, etc. Take a ride, share to the event. Okay, take a ride share to the event or ask a friend to drive you both to increase the sense of mystery. Woo! All right. Oh my gosh, okay. A bunch came out and I pulled the one from the bottom and it said private dancer. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Tina Turner, private dancer. <laughs> okay. All right, so hire an instructor or a private dance lesson for you and your sweetie. Okay, so that's the thing. You know, I was getting that yesterday, like, and day before yesterday was like, um, doing something like that would uh, increase your social circle. Okay. All right. Leo. Oh, wait. No, it's not Leo. It's Cancer. Oh, wait. Gemini. <laughs> Gemini. Okay, Gemini is, wants to try things out, removing obstacles. Okay, so I feel like a lot of you are doing this right now. Uh, removing obstacles and making a clear path for yourself. The key is to pay attention to your details as you're moving along. Don't rush through it, whatever you're doing now. And there, there will be a transformation, but pay attention to the details and paperwork and stuff like that is what I'm getting. I feel like that's you. All right. Now I feel like these are the ones that uh, are potentials here. Okay, so I'm getting a water sign here. Okay, earthy, earthy fire I'm getting. Okay. Oh, someone with unconditional love. And self-love. Okay. That's interesting. I did an Aries pop-up reading, and uh, it was all about raising the energy so that um, it's it was a more comfortable energy. And I feel like uh, if you've been in your polar energy and you haven't felt that positive, this self-love is going to help you move in a, a heart open-hearted space okay but I feel like there's someone with 